one of your athletic trainers at Methodist University. And I just wanted to share a few tips on how to be a healthier and happier you for this mental health week. These uncertain times with COVID-19 bring out so many emotions and stressors that quite frankly affect us so differently. And there are so many things that we can't control right now. But I'm here to offer and remind you two things that you can control. The first step is sleep. That's right, I said it. It's easy, right? Or is it? I mean, it's really easy to get out of a routine when it comes to sleep, especially during these times. I mean, we might stay up super late or sleep in extra, but this poor habit can ultimately affect our mental health. So I'm encouraging you to set a bedtime reminder and follow it. So when it says, a ringling saying 15 minutes before bed, that means stop what you're doing, go brush your teeth, and go to bed. And when it goes off at 8 a.m. in the morning, you don't hit snooze, no, not 9, 10, or any times, you get up. I'm also encouraging you to get at least eight hours of good and consistent sleep each night, even if it means you don't have anything going on that day. My second tip, to a healthier and happier you is to reach for healthier snacks. When we fuel our bodies with junk, we ultimately feel like, well, junk. So grab those fresh fruits and vegetables to munch on. Maybe look up a new recipe that you've been wanting to try. Heck, maybe you're the next Gordon Ramsay and you just haven't discovered it yet. This is your chance, people. So cook and eat good because there's a lot of really good and healthy foods out there. So, I challenge you, yes you, I said you, to set those alarms, get a good night's sleep, hide those gummy bears out of sight, not in your tummy of course, try a new recipe, and you know, just take some simple steps that you can control to a happier and healthier you. See you next time.